Yo, what's going on guys? In this video, we're going to be taking a look at all the sneak peeks and leaks that we got in the stream on EA's Twitch. Their link will be in the description down below. You can go check out their streams. They stream every Tuesday and Thursday, but today we had a special stream on Wednesday just for these sneak peeks. So we got a brand new live pass and a monthly master. And make sure you're sticking around to the end of the video where Nick accidentally leaked some of the 4th of July players that will be coming to the game soon. So make sure you stick around for that. Okay, so let's get into this with the brand new live pass for this month or for the next month on the 1st of July. Now this will be coming out tomorrow on Thursday, 1st of July. We're kicking things off with the new month. So you've got this and the monthly master stuff. So let's have a look and in the store. You can see here, you can buy the live pass up to you whether you spend your money and buy that then you can also buy the live pass plus now if you want to spend the money and get this you will be getting a 96 overall tyler hero with that as well so it's up to you whether you want to spend the actual money to be able to get him that's up to you but let's go on to the next screenshot so as you can see the master here is 100 overall zion williamson he is another power power forward and i know nick said that kc wasn't really happy with that because we have had quite a lot of power power forwards i think we've had loads of them someone put up on discord um just how many we've had and they put a load like a, a collage of them as there's so many of them but anyway we've had a load of them as well as strategic point guards there aren't any strategic point guards luckily um in any of the stuff that we got today but there is this power power forward 100 overall zion williamson he is 100 overall so that makes up for it slightly he has got some decent stats and we'll go on to them later but then as you can see here on the left just above the live pass you can see the usa flag for the 4th of july stuff so that's definitely coming to the game Nick confirmed that it is coming to the game. I think he said it's coming out on Sunday. So that's in a couple of days time. So that will be coming out very soon. So make sure you stay tuned because I'll be doing some videos on that when the promo actually does drop so how you can get the Masters. But that's our 100 overall Zion Williamson. Now we do have some of the stats over here. We won't look at these ones because they're the more of the summary ones. We'll look at the in-depth ones. So you can see his speed is pretty good. So we'll be getting to the paint really quickly. And that dunking, of course, is really high. We don't know whether he's got the dunk package. Maybe he does with a dunk that high. He might actually have that dunk package but he doesn't give out any boost to the team. So he isn't that good in that sense, but he has got some really good stats, 103 strength. So he's going to be bullying people in the paint. Three point shot, not too high, but not too low either. He's pretty decent and he is a power forward. So he probably won't be knocking down that many three point shots. The mid range shot, 95, pretty good. And the rebounding stats, we can't really see the defense rebounding stat, but the offensive rebounding stat, 98, which is just crazy with boosts from your team it'll be absolutely nuts if you want to know how you can boost up your players a ton go check out the card that should be popping up now you can go boost up your players maybe five overalls or six overalls higher but this card is going to be looking like it's a pretty good card dunking the ball really well and he is fairly high overall then if you're free to play like me you can see this is going to be your free to play live pass master i probably won't go for him because he is a finesse point guard i've already got that stephen curry i don't really need jal morant he is looking like a pretty decent card though if you are trying to get him because i know stephen curry was paid to win to get or you could buy him on the auction house luckily i managed to get him on the giveaway on ea's twitch stream so maybe you can get lucky with some giveaways on ea's twitch stream make sure you go follow them or you want to try and grind for this 96 overall jam run but we do have that 97 steve nash so it depends whether you're finesse strategic or power it depends which ones you want to go for but if you're finesse i definitely suggest maybe trying to grind for him because you can get it no money spent and it is possible to get throughout the whole month if you just grind out doing your objectives stuff like that you get the live pass points you need and you will be able to get jam Morant before the end of the month pretty easily looking at some of his stats again the speed and agility are above 100 they're crazy his quickness is 100 as well dunking and layup is also really high like that zion williamson card scoring with contact is 100 three point shot a lot higher than zion williamson's but he is a point guard so he's going to be shooting the three ball a lot more 92 three point shot 95 mid-range shot lower rebounding stats but again he's a point guard so he's not going to be doing that but he's going to be getting to the paint like zion really well he hasn't got as much strength as zion but he is like he is in real life he will be knocking down some threes here and there the dunking getting those nice dunks in again we don't know whether he's got the dunk package hopefully he will because that get, makes the game a lot more exciting those are some of his defensive stats over there not the best defender but he isn't going to be defending that much he will be on the offense a lot more then as you can see here um you can see on the premium live pass you do get two masters and this is the first of the masters like we had Bradley Bill, I think it was. This time you got a 96 overall, DeAndre Ayton. He's been playing well for the Suns at the moment. He is a strategic center. So whether you need that or not, it's up to you. We have got quite a few strategic centers at the moment. We've got Yao Ming. We've got that Bam Adebayo. And we've got quite a few other ones, but he's nice. He's looking like he's going to be pretty good for your team if you do want to get him. But he isn't giving out any boost. So maybe you've got to balance that out 
with your team but he is a premium player so it's, again it depends on whether you buy their life pass his stats are looking all right not as good as zion or Jal morant he has got a really high offensive and defensive rebounding 97 and 96 they're looking pretty decent he's a little bit slower than the other two um, but that's the usual for him then you got a dunking and 94 again lower than the other two mid-range shot 91 so he's looking like an all right decent card not as good as the Jal morant or the zion williamson but decent nonetheless then you got his defensive stats over here. He's a little bit of a better defender. As you can see, 95 offensive box out and 94 defensive box out. 91 interception. So he's going to be looking like he's a pretty decent card on the defensive side. But again, not as good as Zion or that Jal Morant. Then as you can see, if you spend the money and buy the premium live pass, you will be getting this jersey over here. City Pelicans jersey, of course, because you've got that Zion Williamson. And he is giving out an elite court general boost. So that's looking like a pretty decent jersey over there. Then you've also got another court over here, the Smoothie King Center. Again, the Pelicans court, like Zion Williamson, because he plays for the Pelicans. Then you can see it's giving out an elite Stonewall boost as well. So that's looking pretty decent. Then the boost item that we're getting with the free live pass is this Cake Baby. Now for me, I don't know about you guys, it looks a little bit creepy here. He's going to be your live pass coach. He's giving out an elite glass cleaner boost. Not the best coach. You've got the medals. They're probably the best. And you've got that Steve Kerr or the Steve Nash. They're pretty decent as well. I think Steve Kerr is probably the best coach you can have if you're a finesse player. Strategic medal is the best if you've got strategic lineup, if you can afford it on the auction house or you can get it in the sets but this is looking like a decent boost um it's just going to give out a little bit more boost if you want to get him again that face is still a little bit creepy to me but yeah that's basically all the stuff that we got in the live pass now let's head over to all the stuff we got to do with the monthly master stuff so straight away we got this starting off to do with the monthly masters and you can see there are two monthly masters like we had last time you got a 98 bill russell and a 98 wilt chamberlain now both of these guys you can pick which play style you want them to have whether you want them to be strategic power finesse or any of the three player styles you want them to be, you can pick, and that's probably the best thing you can do. Like that Vince Carter we had, you can pick which one you want. Now you can see there are two of them over here. I'll probably be going for the strategic ones because that's what my lineup is, but the Bill Russell is giving out that Stonewall boost, and it is a platinum boost. It's looking like like we had with the Magic Johnson giving out a platinum court general boost, and then you got the Wilt Chamberlain. Now he is only giving out a gold boost. So yeah, those are the two boosts that them two are giving out. They're fairly low boosts, um, but they are going to be pretty good. I'd probably go for the platinum boost because it does, I think, boost a little bit more than the gold boost, obviously. That's why it's higher rank and that stuff. But they're both 98, so they are fairly high overall. And the main thing is you can pick which one you want to go for, like which play style you want to go for. As you can see, it's similar stuff here. You've got the leaderboard back over here. That's probably a good thing. A lot of people grinded just to get off the leaderboard. Spend your 60,000 monthly master emblems to get the Wilt Chamberlain or the Bill Russell. Now, Nick said, if you do manage to get any of these out of the pack, you won't be able to select which um, play style they are in the pack. Because if you think about it in the pack, you're just going to get any random of the six cards, any one of them, any play style, if you get lucky enough to get one of them. But then when you actually do some of the milestones over here, you can select which ones you want. As you can see, it's similar stuff, exactly the same amount. You can see you get some NBA cash at 40,000, some select packs for the lower overall masters. You get some life pass points. Then at 50,000, you get the 96 um, select pack. And then at 60,000, you do get that 98 select pack. And then you have to just keep going if you want to try and get both of them or you want to get more than one from a similar play style, maybe sell it. Then you got 100k you need to get to get both of them over there. Now, some of their stats, as you can see, again, this Bill Russell is giving out that platinum stonewall boost, as you can see on the right hand side. His dunking is all right. 91, 94 layup. He's going to be pretty good inside the paint and getting those rebounds again. 95 and 93 for offensive and defensive rebounding. And his strength is 96. So he's going to be a bully in the paint which is pretty good. Some of his defensive stats here, this is where it really starts to look like a great card over here. So his box out's really high, his post strength's really high, his footwork's really high, his hands in the post's really high, his block is really high. That's why he's giving out that stonewall boost because he is a really great blocker over there. He's going to be blocking quite a lot of um, balls in the paint. So that's going to be a pretty good addition to your team. Then also you've got this 98 Wilt Chamberlain. Again, he's giving out that gold bully ball boost, which is probably a little bit worse than the platinum boost, but it's up to you which one you want to go for. Again, this one's a finesse center, but you can pick whichever play style and all the stats will be exactly the same. It just depends on which play style they are. Now, as you can see, he's got 103 strength, 100 inside the paint shot, 99 scoring with contact, 97 dunk, 97 layup. So he's got slightly higher offensive stats than that um, Bill Russell. And he's got some pretty high rebounding stats over there, 98 in both offensive and defensive. And in his defensive stats, they are pretty good, but they're probably not as good 
as the Bill Russell stats. So on the offensive side, I think Wilt's slightly better. But on the defensive side, I think Bill Russell is probably a little bit better. That's why you've got the different boosts they're giving out. So this one's going to have 112 offensive post strength, 95 for both box outs, and then 100 uh, de defensive post strength and 100 post shot. So it's looking like a pretty decent card. Now going on to the 4th of July stuff that we did end up getting. Nick accidentally leaked this card over here. He has a 95 Carmelo Anthony and you can see it's a 4th of July player. Now I reckon this one might be a store player because this is where normally the store players show up. He's a finesse small forward. I don't think he's just going to be the only master but it is looking like it's very similar card art to the previous season in season 4 where we had this sort of stamp effect. And it was a pretty similar stuff. Maybe just the middle bits change. Um, but that's going to be there in the game when we do go in. I think Nick said it's going to be in there on Sunday. So that's going to be a pretty decent thing that we get. Because I think we're in dire need of a new promo. Stuff that we can have. And of course we'll have that conference finals promo that will end soon. And then we'll have that finals promo. So let me know all of your thoughts in the comment section down below. About all the stuff that we got today. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.